growing a love for STEM. That's the goal of one program in the New River Valley that's helping some students make the grade in science, tech, engineering, and math. It's a partnership program with Virginia Tech that's already started expanding to other parts of the Commonwealth. Good Day Virginia anchor Charmaine Brown shows us how students are learning to add new tech to old practices. It's advancement in STEM technology blossoming right here at Virginia Tech. The water from the tank will connect to the watering pump. Doctoral students design, build, and program these unique robots called STEM bots. You can use this indoors, outdoors, in a greenhouse. There's not really any limitations to where it can be used. This is part of the integrated STEM education program in the School of Education. Professor Dr. John Wells has been working on this program for years. One of the components of this initiative is to um, demonstrate the kinds of higher order thinking that students in the career and technical education classes, specifically the technology education and the agri-science, are demonstrating and required to, to use. Blacksburg Middle School students are testing it. The idea is to hone their critical thinking skills. The bots address all of the STEM disciplines, science, technology, engineering, and math, across other disciplines like agriculture. Students could actually be engaged in a hands-on application and they could actually be growing plants from a remote location. The STEM bots use a web-based program that allows students to program this irrigation system to take care of these plants. This one will make like a student connection between the real life and, and the, the thing that they learn in the classroom. The bot with the right 3D printed tool can plant water, pluck, and prune. I want to see students really understand what it means to do technological engineering, design-based learning, and the things that they can learn from engaging in those kinds of challenges. While this program started here at Virginia Tech, it's growing. Dr. Wells has collaborated with other professors in the Commonwealth at Old Dominion University and at Hampton University. This is very important because we realize that uh, this gives us an opportunity to enhance student success in STEM education. Student success here in Virginia and eventually throughout the United States. Making the grade, I'm Charmaine Brown, WFXR News.